Kenya as Ismail Changawa and Tanzania as Shana Mau claimed the 2023 championship title for the men's and women's singles, respectively. And Uganda's under 14, Afoya Roth Hilda, was crowned the junior champion. It's a privilege for me, and I'm so happy. And also, my team and my family are going to have fun uh, for my glory. And uh... It was a privilege playing with everyone in the tournament, and it feels so nice to win it because it was a nice experience and playing with different players. I feel so happy and great because this is my last year in under 14. So I'm preparing for uh, Zonos next year. Though the final week of the tournament was marred by a heavy downpour in Kampala, the players' determination for the event was undeterred. Uh, it's not about the rain. It's about the playing. It's, it can rain and then you go back and stay focused again and win the tournament. So I just stay focused on my thing. I mean, you can't control really the, the rain. So it wasn't different, but it was just sometimes you would play and then you're in the rhythm and then it would rain, so you have to like start all over again. So it wasn't a big difference. The 2023 event came 10 years after the previous one and the organizers together with the National Council of Sports and the Uganda Olympics Committee say this is a start to a great revival in the game. The demands are going to be many in the upcoming championship. Uh, more players are going to be here, the senior ones, and we anticipate that right from officiation, right from umpiring, uh, courts management, everything is going to be at the top of the game. And we strongly believe it is going even to attract more sponsors as well. They are going to have uh, more partners with us, and we are likely to have a fantastic championship ahead. Seeing the young players, budding players coming from various walks of life, from various countries, it is a good thing. We appreciate the Uganda Tennis Association of Uganda for reviving this tournament. We believe these are the platforms where we will get the future greats or elite players that can take part in the various big games like the Olympics uh, and the Commonwealth Games. The two-week championship had over 139 participants in the junior, seniors and professional categories. The event ran from the 27th of November to the 9th of December 2023 at the Lugogo and Kampala tennis courts. Grace Joyce Kemigisa, UBC News.